Hi, I'm Phil, co-founder of AttackForge. In this video, I'm going to show you how to map an attack chain in AttackForge to MITRE's attack framework. So what are attack chains? Attack chains help demonstrate exactly what an attacker is doing at every step of the way in a simple and easy to understand picture. It helps clients understand attack paths and focus remediation where it's needed most. MITRE ATT&CK Framework, on the other hand, is a knowledge base of adversary tactics and techniques based on real-world attack patterns. It provides threat models and methodologies to help you better plan, prepare, and defend against real-world attacks. On my screen is an attack chain I had created earlier based on a recent pen test with the help of Jay Davis at Indigo IT Labs, one of the best pen testers I've had the pleasure of working with. So let's step through this attack chain. The objective here is to demonstrate how an attacker is able to compromise a client's on-premise corporate network, as well as their Office 365 environment. It starts with an attacker first gaining access to the network, either through a phishing attack finding a weakness in remote access solution or internet facing infrastructure, which is connected to the network or via breaching physical security. The attacker performs reconnaissance and exploits weaknesses in network configuration in order to capture hashes. The attacker then relays the hash to a server in order to gain shell access, exploiting weaknesses in SMB signing. The account is found to have local admin access on the server. The attacker then dumps local password hashes on the server and uses a parser hash attack against other servers on the network, gaining access to another server. On the next server, the attacker is able to run Mimikatz and evade endpoint detection. This provides access to clear text credentials for a domain admin account. The attacker now has access to the domain controller and dumps all password hashes in order to gain further access to other systems in the environment. The attacker now goes after high value assets, including company ERP, CRM, databases containing sensitive uh, data, uh, including personally identifiable information, or anything valuable to criminals. The attacker then discovers that multi-factor authentication is not required when attempting to log into Office 365 from inside the corporate network, which is common in a lot of company environments. Therefore, leveraging the highly privileged accounts that were cracked, the attacker now has global admin credentials to Office 365, thus reaching the end goal of a complete takeover. Now let's map this to MITRE's attack framework. I have MITRE's attack framework open in front of me. Going back to the top of the attack chain, let's map each step the attacker is performing. We're going to click the update button to start the mapping. On the right, we have a MITRE attack button for each link in the chain. We're going to use this to select a tactic from the attack framework. Using the guidance provided by the MITRE attack framework, let's go ahead and start our mapping process. The first one we're going to select is initial access. This relates to the tactic provided on the MITRE attack framework page. Let's go ahead and select the rest. Now this one is a discovery action. Now we're performing credential access and another credential access. This further action is again discovery, followed by further credential access and another discovery action. Here we have a collection 
tactic being used. Now we have privilege escalation, followed by another collection, followed by lateral movement, followed by another collection. Now we have credential access. And lastly, impact. We have now completed the mapping. How easy was that? Let's go ahead and save it, then go back and view our mapping. So there you have it, mapping to MITRE attack framework using attack chains and attack forge. Give it a try, see how you go. You can create this for all different types of attacks. MITRE provides guidance for all attacks based on various platforms and environments, including Windows, Mac, Linux, Cloud, Mobile, and even industrial control systems for those hardcore hackers. For more information, check out our other videos on our YouTube channel, or check out our support site at support.attackforge.com. Thanks for watching.